Coach Billy Dillon, Matt Durbin, just uh, wanted to wish you a happy birthday and um, just wanted to really thank you for, um, you know, really giving me the opportunity to be a part of your team at the times that were the toughest for me. And, um, you know, if it wasn't for you, I, I definitely wouldn't be where I am today. And, you know, you just, you really uh, show me love and loyalty and um, that's what I think about when uh, I think about Narbon baseball and I wear this hat. Um, you know, growing up in San Pedro, um, you get a lot of a lot of gossip and a lot of um, a lot of rumors spread, and uh, you really don't get to know a person, or you assume things about a person before even going up to who you're assuming about, and. I just really respect how you sat down and you got to know me for me and not the situation that I was in. And that right there just showed me to never give up on somebody and to really see if we can help that person out and see if we can cut out those flaws. And um, you definitely did that for me. And um, that's, that's the love. That's the love I feel when I wear this hat. And um, as you can tell, um, you know, the love's right there from your younger, younger brother being able to make this video and be able to come up with this idea. You can see the love and loyalty right there. And that's what I cherish about this program and how it's ran. And um, keep doing it, keep doing it. So um, my favorite... Coach Dylan moment would have had to been, let's see here, Wednesday, 060408. Daily Breeze. And we got Dylan Leads Rides to Respectability. And who we got? Those Avila Beaners. We got myself. And Chan Ho Park. And that right there just shows your respect that you get not only from, you know, the people in town, but the people outside of town. And the accomplishments that you made and adversity that you overcame. And that right there, being able to see my coach as, you know, leads the rides and is coach of the year, that just that just motivated me that much more. What's up, Coach Dylan? Happy birthday. This is Danny Ortega, Flick, number five. Um, you know, what does Narbonne baseball mean to me? It means everything to me. Um, you know, you were honestly, I had you for two years as a coach, and those two years went by too quick. Um, you know, you were young at the time. You could relate to us, and we felt like you were a teammate, not only our coach, um, until you made us run about eight miles every day, but we probably deserved it. Uh, my favorite Bill Dillon moment. <laughs> uh, I think that had to be Miracosta when um, Madison charged the mound. Uh, Chris Compa got thrown out the game. Um, you know, the, I think Miracosta was ragging on Brian Walters, you know, with his goggles. And uh, you were pretty fired up after the game. We thought we were going to run. You know, we, we were all ready to line up. We were pretty bummed out, but you came over and you congratulated us, you know, for standing up for ourselves, and, um, you know, we, we thank you for that, you know. We didn't have to run. Um, and what has Narbonne Baseball taught me? You know, it's taught me a lot, you know. Um, it's taught me to go hard as, as hard as I can, you know. Uh, nothing's going to be given to us. Um, I think all those practices, you know, helped us out. Um, you know, things thrown at us now and, you know, in real life are just, you know, they're simple. Um, and that's all because of you guys, you know, you guys taught us that, you know, nothing's easy and every day is like an at-bat, you know, we got to grind it out. And I just want to thank you for those, uh, all those moments, the two years I had you. Unfortunately, I, I wish I had you all four years, but, you know, it wasn't the circumstances. Um, but yeah, you know, hopefully we'll get some softball in soon again, maybe summertime. And I uh, just want to say happy birthday, happy birthday to you. I think you're turning 40 now, getting old, man. Live it up.
See you later. All right, Dylan. Um, sorry if I don't have my Narbonne gear. I can't find it, but what Narbonne baseball means to me it means family, it means friendships. It means more than that. It means uh, it's hard to explain. Um, my favorite Bill Dylan moment is when I remember my freshman year with Manny Scalera. We were out by the center by center field. We we're all taking a knee, and Manny Scalera was talking to him. And next thing you know, like in the middle of Manny saying something, he just interrupts and is like, "The fuck is that in your ear?" Oh, it's just a work coat. Oh my god, man, that's the most funniest thing I've ever heard in my life. Right in the middle of what he was saying. But anyways, and the last thing what what Bill Dylan taught me was basically hard work. Working hard gives you pays back. That's what basically it's taught me. So happy birthday, Bill Dylan, and you have no idea what you have taught me in my life. Thank you very much. And you know, I just I just really wanted to thank you, Coach, for all the good times we had together. You know, you and I and the team, the care, the relationships you helped me build. You know, the, the lessons you taught me how to grind and the respect. And you know, it's not about baseball. You know. Take a lot of pride in that stuff, you know, and you're always there, like you're always letting us hit on the field or take some bad or take some fielding practice, whatever it is. Like you're the reason like everyone gets better and why we're all close to you, why we're all close together. You're the reason why who we are who we are we who we are who we are today. I really want to thank you for everything you did, all the time and effort you put in, in that field. Um enjoy your birthday, coach, man, and you don't have like I said earlier, you don't have the time that you that you could have. You put a lot of time at that field. So enjoy it with your family. Thank you for everything, man. Narbon Baseball. Hey, Coach. How's it going? Happy 40th birthday. Got a couple questions here to answer. Um, my favorite Bill Dillon moment is, uh, number one, I actually met Coach Dillon back at Banning while he was my JV coach. And uh, that's one of my moments, you know, winning the Marine League with him. Um, so technically that's his first Marine League uh, championship. Uh, another Bill Dillon moment is uh, one of the trips out to Vegas while I was coaching with him. Um, we were all hanging out at Coach's room after a night out. Uh, we were drinking uh, some milk and having some cookies, and by that I mean Jack Daniels and Krispy Kreme donuts. And uh, we're watching TV, all hanging out, having a good time. And out of nowhere, you know, he stops and tells us, "Hey guys, did you guys hear? Coach Robinson died." And uh, from then on out, the whole trip, you know, for everything is like, "Hey, you know, cheers for Coach Robinson." I know it's kind of silly, but kind of funny at the time for us, and something that stuck with me. Uh, what does Narbonne baseball mean to me? Kind of ties into uh, what life lesson I've uh, learned from Coach Bill Dillon. Um, everything, you know, Narbonne baseball just means family. Uh, tied with the life lesson. Uh, you know, Coach Dillon giving me the opportunity to coach, gave me a second chance of uh, being around the game that I love, um, getting to know a bunch of these kids, being a part of that family, and uh, just uh, teaching the kids uh, the game of baseball a little bit more and actually learning from them. So um, that's pretty much it. Coach, I wish you all the best to you and your family. Thanks again for giving me the opportunity to coach and uh, be a part of your family. Coach Dylan, happy birthday. This is Jason Delgado. As a friend, as my coach, as my life coach, as one of my role models in life, I want to wish you nothing but the best today and always in your career with your family and everything. Uh, what Narbon baseball means to me is, I mean, hard work, discipline, dedication, grit. Uh, I've taken Narbon baseball style with me after I played high school at El Camino, even though you don't want me to play there, but you know, I showed those guys what Narbon baseball and city baseball is all about at Harbor. Um, same thing, I mean, same style. Even when I went to, uh, to William Penn over in Iowa, I showed those guys how, what it's about, what, what wearing doses is. Um, hard 90s, you know, diving for balls that weren't even close. Nine fives, you know, I, I outworked all those guys due to learning it from you, from your coaching style and from the, from the staff right there at Narbonne Baseball. My favorite uh, Coach Dillon moment has to be uh, when you would chew us out. I mean, me and the, the seniors in uh, class of 2012, we would always make fun of you. I think Ricky Perez did the best impersonation of uh, when you would chew us out, when you just yell and like spit would be caught in between both of your lips. I don't know, it's the funniest thing. I mean, a lot of guys can relate to that. And uh, I'll never forget that. You know, I miss actually getting chewed out from you. I mean, it wasn't just running. It was more discipline. I mean, it was more of a mentality more than it was physically. And life lessons that I learned from you, coach. I mean, 
is to never stop until it's done. I mean, never take breaks, but actually tell when it's done. I learned a lot from you when, uh, when I would work at your house over the summers, um, working long hours. I mean, it was tough under the sun. You know how it was. I mean, Mike Perez, Isaac, Padilla. I mean, we all worked with you, and it's something that I learned from you a lot. I mean, just getting it done, um, never settle, and always, always want to do the best. And I want to thank you, Coach, for everything that you've taught, for, that you've taught me, that you've taught all of the number one baseball family, and thank you for everything. We're here shooting a special video just for you for your 40th birthday. We want to wish you a happy 40th birthday on behalf of myself and everyone else here. Happy birthday, Coach. Happy birthday, Coach. We wish you many, many more years of many, many beautiful birthdays. I can't believe we've been coaching for many years. I kind of lose track. It's been so long, but it's definitely been a pleasure. I'm grateful for your friendship, and our friendship has bonded as family. And once again, happy 40th birthday. Happy birthday on three. Happy birthday on three. One, two, three. Happy, happy birthday! Narwhal baseball to me is family, you know. We had a pretty good bond between all the players. There was some people got on each other's nerves, but at the end of the day, we were there and we always had each other's backs. Happy birthday, Coach Dylan. What's up, Coach? This is Adrian. I'm wishing you a happy 40th birthday. I hope you enjoy your day with your family and many more to come. What does Narbar baseball mean to you? Narbar baseball means to me, it goes far beyond the field. When, when I was still in high school, people knew, students, staff, other coaches, they knew that baseball players got hot after it, on and off the field. What is your favorite Bill Dillon moment? My favorite Bill Dillon moment is when he saved all our lives in 2014 from crashing into USC's library. Well, what life lesson have you learned from Coach Bill Dillon? Life lesson I've learned from you, Coach, no matter what you're doing, just do it at the best of your ability. Even though you don't like it, just keep grinding. What's up, Dylan? Big 40, dude. You're getting old, brother. Um, so they told me to answer three questions for you, and uh, the first one is, what it does Narbonne mean to me? What Narbonne means to me, honestly, is just, you know, it's a place where I grew up, a place that, for me, um, I learned a lot, you know, in a place where you are coaching that, and you were being there, you know, I respect you a lot, so, you know, it means a lot to me that you're there, and that, you know, honestly, that, you know, I've learned a lot there from you, you know, I think that's why it means so much to me, um, but yeah, and then um, the most memorable moment of you is, I think, when we're at Redondo, dude, this always sticks out to me, because, you know, it really makes me think about it a lot, it's one time when we're getting our butts kicked, dude, and like, I don't know if we got our butts kicked, but I think we were losing or something like that, and we played bad. You know, at that time, we were probably the top team in the Marine League, and we lost, so we were pretty mad, and I remember after the game, you saying, like, you know, we played horrible, and it's not only your guys' fault, but it's my fault, too, and I, and I was kind of stuck in awe, like, what the heck is this guy talking about, you know? And you ended up burying yourself with us, and I remember the coach looking at you like, damn, what the hell is that guy doing, you know? But yeah, dude, I think that was a big mo like moment that stuck out to me that, that, you know, I always remember of you because, you know, that really made me realize how much of a motherfucker you are, excuse my language, but, you know, you were, you were one tough-ass dude, and I knew there was only one way to win, and, you know, we had a great leader to follow us and lead us through, so that was awesome for me, man. That really stuck out to me. And I think the one main thing that you have taught me, honestly, man, is... More than anything, man, being mentally tough, you know, be mentally tough, not being soft to any, to any degree, you know, um, and honestly, just um, more than anything, how to be a, a, a good teammate, you know, and I think you've done a great job of just putting that and installing that in people. Um, you've taught me a lot of how, how to go about the game, and, and you know, it, you know, you were a big reason why I got to where I got, and, and you know, that's something I won't, I won't ever forget, so... I appreciate you for all of you done for me and my family. And honestly, dude, I just want to wish you a happy 40th birthday, man. I hope you have a great one, dude. All right, man. What does Narbonne baseball mean to me? I'll show you. Favorite Coach Dylan moment. Most memorable probably is uh, we're getting roasted for some reason in the dugout. Uh, all of a sudden, Coach's phone goes off and Kelly Clarkson 
since you've been gone is the ringtone. Life lessons at Narbonne. Most important, probably hard work, uh, dedication, uh, punctuality, accountability. A lot of lessons learned at Narbonne that, you know, helped me out throughout my life. Uh, never was really a good student, uh, but Narbonne baseball and baseball in general uh, really helped me achieve some stuff that I, I didn't really think was possible. Since I didn't like school, uh, I never really seen myself uh, going to college, getting a degree, and right now, you know, first generation, uh, my parents are both from Mexico, and I'm the first generation here, I got my bachelor's degree, uh, I bought my house, um, did a lot of stuff that I, I don't think would be possible without Narbonne Baseball and Coach Dylan leading Narbonne Baseball. So I just want to say happy birthday, Coach. You know, thanks for everything. Uh, you really uh, impact, impact a lot of players' lives. Uh, just keep it up. You need that ring. Happy birthday, Coach. What's up, Coach? Danny Taylor here. Chris Dillon asked us to make a video for his gay boy brother's birthday, so happy birthday. He also asked us to answer three questions. Number one being, what does Narbonne Baseball mean to you? Now, Narbonne Baseball to me means enjoy the time while you have it because not everybody gets the opportunity, and it goes by the blink of an eye. Um, through, through my Narbonne career, I really noticed that, and even with life now, it's going by like that. So just enjoy the time while you have it. Be patient. Take every opportunity that you can get. Uh, number two is, what is your favorite Billy Dillon moment? Uh, my favorite Billy Dillon moment was sophomore year, Coaches of Earth Players. You were in, I'm pretty sure it was left field, it might have been center, but you made a diving or sliding play. And it showed me that transitioning from the infield to the outfield, I wasn't just being taught by somebody who didn't know the game. You coached it as well as knew it and played it. So it, it made me want to listen to you more and be more coachable. So thank you for that. And you really made me the outfielder I am today, which is a pretty damn good outfielder, I might say myself. Uh, number three is what life lesson have you learned from Coach Billy Dillon? Um, let's see. The number one life lesson I learned from you was no matter how hard and shitty things get, you will always get through them as long as you do not quit. Um, I mean, really, if you can last a, a Narbonne burial, then you can last anything. So, Coach, thank you for this opportunity to play for you. Thank, for, thank you for this opportunity to make this video for your birthday. Um, I love you from the bottom of my heart. And if you ever, ever, ever want to go to Vegas for your 40th birthday, just hit me up. <laughs> All right, thanks. See ya. Happy birthday, Coach. To me, Narbonne Baseball means having pride. Whenever I represent for Narbonne Baseball by wearing the gear, by telling my friends, my coworkers, my students at Stephen White Middle School that I not only played for Narbonne, that I also coach at Narbonne, I feel very proud whenever I tell them that. Um, the most memorable moment I have of you, Coach, was when you first started coaching. It was summer of 2003. Uh, we had just played at Redondo. We got our butts kicked. The very first time you had us doing dive backs, man. Uh, after that, you had us on a knee. You're giving us the post-game talk. Then all of a sudden, you stop mid-sentence. You're like, Joey, give me eye contact. Joey, give me eye contact. Uh, then you continued on. If we're about to wrap up and leave, we tell you, a few of us tell you, Coach, uh, Joey Whalen, uh, he's cockeyed. The look on your face is priceless. Uh, Coach, there's been so many life lessons that I've learned from you. Um, man, where do I begin? I think working hard for the things that you want in life is the one that it just comes straight up to my mind. Uh, life is hard. It's very easy to give up on things. It's a tough world out there. Um, but if you just work hard for the things that you want, then almost all the time you'll get what you want in life. Thank you, Coach. Happy birthday. You never know when Coach Dillon's going to drop some life lessons on you at practice. Uh, the one that always sticks out to me is that when you choose your glasses, sunglasses, make sure they wrap around the sides right here so that you don't get crow's feet. Hey, Coach Dillon, it's Pedro Delgado, class of 2008. 
first and foremost, I want to wish you a happy birthday. We were sent out a couple questions we were uh, asked to answer for you for today's special day. The first one was, what does Narvan Baseball mean to you? To me, Narvan Baseball means hustle, hard work, dedication, values, and grit. You taught us a lot of home values that that's really important. Uh, what is my favorite Bill Dillon moment? My favorite Bill Dillon moment has to be when I was a freshman. I uh, inter-squatted with the varsity team because your second baseman was out for the day, so I had to fill in for that role. I was facing Brian Walters, who, by the way, threw about like 97 miles per hour. I fouled off four or five pitches. I got the count full. I ended up fouling two or three more pitches after that. And from the third base side, you yell out, Pedro, let's go. And in the back of my mind, I'm thinking, man, first of all, I don't belong here in varsity. And I'm facing a guy who's unhittable. And it seems like Coach Dillon wants me to hit a home run, which I thought was a lot, a lot to you for, to ask for. But that's always what you did. You expected a lot from us. And that was great. Uh, my favorite life lesson that I have learned from you is to always be on time. I always call if you're going to be late or if you're not going to make it. You know, a lot of discipline. Uh, Dylan, if you look around, all these alumni, everyone that's here, we're all here for you because you have played a big part in our life, even if you think you haven't. The other day, um, I know this is supposed to be quick, but the other day I was asked who has played a big role in my life, someone who was not a relative. And I had to say my high school baseball coach, Coach Dylan. He went beyond just the sport that he taught you. He taught you how to be a man. He taught you how to be responsible. And he taught you how to value your parents and how to value everyone around you. Uh, so, Bill Dylan, even if you don't know, um, you, have, you have played a great part of my life. And I want to thank you for being a positive role model. Happy birthday. Cheers to many more. I love you, Coach. Go Narvon. Happy 40th birthday, Coach. Uh, what Narvon baseball means to me is to always work hard and give 110%. Um, my favorite Bill Dillon moment was probably at Harvard Westlake. Uh, we had just got in trouble for something, and we were going to take infield outfield, and Coach Dillon comes up, hits the ball to right field, hits it 70 feet foul over the fence, and Isaac Padilla runs, pops the fence, goes and gets the ball, throws it in, and Coach takes the next ball and hits it down the left field line. And Isaac went all over the left field, grabbed it, and threw it in. It was just a funny time. Um, what Coach Dillon has taught for me or taught me in life is that if you want something, work hard for it and you can be successful. So whatever you want, just work hard at it and you can be successful. Once again, happy birthday, Coach. What's up? Happy 40th birthday, Coach Dylan. Uh, how you guys doing? This is Madison Jones, class of 2005. Uh, you know, I'm just doing this video right here for your 40th birthday and um, so we got a couple questions. What does Narbonne Baseball mean to me? And that's uh, friends, family, community, you know, dedication to a sport that we all love. And then my favorite Billy Dillon moment is probably one of the times he's been chewing us out, you know, he does that a lot, you know, his mouth gets all white and foamy all the time. But there's one particular time he was chewing us out and then his phone goes off into a song and it was hilarious. Cue the song. Yeah. So anyway, that was just funny as hell and one of my greatest, uh, you know, moments we could always laugh about when, you know, I talk to the boys about it. What life lesson has uh, Bill Dillon, you know, taught me? And that is that you keep your head up, stay strong, and, you know, always work hard. So anyway, uh, thanks for including me in this video and uh, have a good one. Hey, what's up, Coach Dillon? This is Jorge Lopez. I want to wish you a happy 40th birthday. Your good-looking brother, Chris Dillon, asked us to help him make a video for your 40th birthday, answering three questions. The first one is, what does Narbonne Baseball mean to me? Narbonne Baseball is a family of guys that we didn't even know. We became friends. We still friends till now. Uh, we all had the same goal to hustle, push one another. Uh, when we had to do dive back to someone was slacking off, push them. Uh, the second question is, uh, what is my favorite Coach Dillon moment? And I think it's when you chased us into the locker room, telling us to get out because we weren't practicing hard enough. We had to literally run out without shirts. Some guys had to run without jeans. He didn't want us in front of the baseball field, nowhere near the baseball field, so we had to go into the campus. And then the third question is, what life lesson have I learned from you? And the most important one, I think, is to always be on time. Uh, time, being on time shows the person you are, that you work hard, that you're willing to help others, that you're willing to stay after, and I just want to thank you for everything you did for me and for the rest of the guys. Hey, hey buddy, what are you doing? Uh, I leave my mom's right now. Oh, 
Well, that's what. Are, what you guys a good day or what? Uh, it's the birthday tomorrow. Oh, well, okay. Well, hey, I just hey, want, I, no. I just called to think about. It. I just want to tell you I love you. Oh, love you too, dude. Yeah. yeah we need, I guess I'll check when I tell them where I go. We need to hang out. We definitely do. So for the next couple of weeks, man, we can uh, rush your tech talk to the works. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, just uh, hit me up, and but just wanted to let you know that I love you very much, Billy. Yeah. Go ahead, Billy. Okay. I'll, I'll talk to you. Right. I'll, I'll talk to you. Right. For okay. sure. For sure. Okay. All right. I do. Bye. Bye. Happy birthday, Bill.